The end of the thread is separated into a few thin strands. This makes it difficult to pass the thread through the eye of the needle. The thin strands of thread that we see are made up of still thinner strands called dash, hence the fibers. Dash are made up of yarns and yarns are further made up of fibers, hence the fabrics. The fibers of some fabrics such as cotton, jute, silk and wool are obtained from plants and animals. These are called dash, answer natural fiber. Dash is obtained from the fleece of sheep or goat, answer wool. Dash is also obtained from the hair of rabbits, yak and camels. Answer wool. Dash is drawn from the cocoon of silkworm. Answer silk fiber. Fibers are also made from chemical substances which are not obtained from plant or animal sources. These are called dash. Answer synthetic fibers. Examples of synthetic fibers are dash. Answer polyester, nylon and acrylic. Dash are usually grown at places having black soil and warm climate. Answer cotton plants. The fruits of the cotton plant are about the size of a dash. Answer lemon. After maturing, the balls burst open and the seeds covered with dash can be seen. Answer cotton fibers. Dash looks like covered with snow. Answer cotton field. From these balls, cotton is usually picked up by hand. Fibers are then separated from the seeds by combing. This process is called dash of cotton. Answer ginning. Dash is obtained from the stem of the jute plant. Answer jute fiber. Jute is cultivated during the dash season. Answer rainy. In India, jute is mainly grown in dash. Answer West Bengal, Bihar and Assam. The dash is normally harvested when it is at flowering stage. Answer jute plant. The dash of the harvested plants are immersed in water for a few days. Answer stems. The stems rot and dash are separated by hand. Answer fibers. To make fabrics all 
these fibers are first converted into yarns the process of making yarn from fibers is called dash answer spinning in this process fibers from a mass of cotton wool are drawn out and twisted this brings the fibers together to form a dash answer yarn a simple device used for spinning is a dash also called tuckley answer hand spindle another hand operated device used for spinning is dash answer charka Use of charka was popularized by dash as part of the independence movement answer Mahatma Gandhi ji Mahatma Gandhi ji encouraged people to wear clothes made of homes spun yarn termed as dash and dash imported cloth made in the mills of britain answer kadi and shan to popularize and promote khadi the government of india constituted a body called dash answer khadi and village industries commission in 1956 spinning of yarn on a large scale is done with the help of dash after spinning yarns are used for making fabrics answer spinning machine The process of arranging two sets of yarns together to make a fabric is called dash answer weaving Weaving of fabric is done on dash answer looms Weaving ante neta the dash or either hand operated or power operated answer looms thank you please like share subscribe